All right. Hi. Hi. Welcome to Let's Play 25 Years of Final Fantasy. We are the good friends. We are the good friends. My name is Ryan. My name is Corey. Uh, we, are, we are the good friends. We are, we are. And this is Final Fantasy 1, although <laughs> you could not tell from this screen. No, as we were just discussing, you'll find... Well, we should say, we, we're going to tell you it's Final Fantasy 1. Yeah, you you'll just find have to out, trust us for now. <laughs> find out for sure in maybe like next episode or something. But before we, we can begin... Yeah. Uh, oh, we, yeah. We need to share what, what, what we're drinking. Oh, yeah, because... Because um, no, we drink when we game. Nothing says Final Fantasy either, like a beer called Raftman. 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 Uh, Raftman. That's R-A-F-T-M-A-N, uh, which is an ale brewed from malt wh- whiskey malt. Not malt whiskey. <laughs> Hold on. Slow it down. <laughs> Reversing it. Uh, <laughs> it is a coral sheen ale on Lee's. Yeah. What, I, it's high on Lee's. It's high. It's very. It's way up. I can't even see it. And this beer is by Unibrew. Oh, it is. And yeah, that's true. It has a subtle bouquet and a delicious <laughs> lingering. Oh, aftertaste. And it's bro. Oh, it's brewed in memory of those bygone masters of the forest, who were <laughs> always amenable to setting their differences over settling their differences over an ale and a shot of whiskey. Which makes sense. Um, I guess if it is whiskey flavored beer. I guess maybe Raftman. Maybe it, you can't see this label, but it kind of looks like you would expect them to be on a raft of some kind. Yeah. But apparently they may be in the forest. You know, classic forest rafting. <laughs> yeah, through, uh, that's a mystery that we can unravel as we go. Yeah, but let's give this bad boy a, a yeah, taste. Yeah, a drink in it right there is a clink in it. Drink Cheers. In it. Okay. I like that. That that's that's a good thing to do for when you want to settle your differences. Yeah, <laughs> and we're settling our differences oh, by playing this game. That's tremendous. Yeah. Oh, listen to that sound right there. That's good. That's good menu sound. All right, I wonder how I. Okay, first thing you're gonna want to do, because uh-huh. I learned this the hard way, is change that respond rate so that we don't play in like some molasses mode. How the fuck do I do that? Oh, oh okay. look at that. I think that's fast. I don't. So I eight. I don't know what that means. That's completely unintelligible. <laughs> yep. Do I want it to respond eight or one? Let's go eight. Let's try I eight. I feel higher numbers are faster. I think you're probably right. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, did we make a decision here? Mm. I don't know. Maybe I'm. I'm sure it, it, nope. most people. Have, oh, I don't know. It doesn't any, matter. It doesn't matter which direction I press it. Right. Like, it always goes forward. <laughs> Uh, okay. There's more classes in Final Fantasy than you can actually pick for your initial That's party. That's true. We uh, have our fighter, our thief, our black belt, our red mage, our white mage, and our black mage. So there's six yeah. classes, and but then, we only have four characters. Right. And they eventually like evolve or ascend into another class once you yeah. get a certain point. Yeah. Um, the classic party, I think, is fighter, thief, white mage, black mage. Mm. Uh even that's though it's what, not the default party, I didn't realize... Yeah, does it include Black Belt? It's one of your defaults. That's yeah. really weird. Fighter, Thief, Black Belt, Red Mage. I'm assuming that's Black Belt. could mean anything. <laughs> Blick Belt. Blood Belt. <laughs> um, <laughs> blind Belt. <laughs> oh my. I will definitely want a Fighter, though. Yeah, definitely Fighter. Okay. Uh, what, will, yeah. what will his name be? Yeah, we didn't discuss this at all. But I was <laughs> thinking kind of like... Uh, follow me. Mm-hmm. Uh, new... Late '80s to mid '90s uh, pizza New York New York pizza sitcom cast. So like okay. Tony, I like Tony. Tony it sounds like a fighter. To yeah, me. he's tough, tough Tony. It can be alliterative too. Hmm. If only we had that many hmm. letters. Okay, we'll know. We'll know he's tough. Now what? what uh, then you hit start. Maybe? No. Hit select. No. <laughs> hit another. Oh, you know what? I think you just hit to try to hit A again. Aha, uh-huh, okay. It's a mystery. Now, for our second character. Okay, yeah, Tony's your level-headed, you know. He's got to run the pizza shop. Mm-hmm. But this guy, right? Always yeah. rascaling. Oh, is uh, this a rascal? Yeah, I would imagine so. Okay. Would, would you not? Are I, you feeling rascal? Look I'm at that I'm feeling hair. rascalish. You know, he gets into trouble. He's a rascally exterior, um, you know. So nasty. we're sticking with Thief on this one? I think so. Okay. If that sounds good. So then... I think they become ninjas at some point, which is pretty cool. Um... I'm gonna t- I'm gonna put this out there, and yeah. you can just pick it up if you want to. Absolutely. I'm gonna go Brad. Ooh, Brad is your your rascal. Man. Brad is my rascal. Man. Yeah. All right. I mean, it Brad. could also be like, you know, I'm I'm getting a backstory here. He was like, you know, 
trust fund kid, <laughs> but kind of like, you know, then he lived in, like, he, he voluntarily, like, he's got blue or whatever hair, he's kind of punkin' yeah. right now. He fell in with the wrong crowd. Yeah, well, he's got, like, you know... Because um, as we all know, that's what blue hair means. <laughs> Apparently, that's very, yeah, that's very good. Well, it's got a brash exterior, but it's masking, you know, some deeper, deeper, a, a sensitive mm. soul, you know? It explains why he goes to his goth phase when he becomes a ninja. Yes. He's wearing all true. black. It's good. All right. Okay. I don't know about black belt. I, I don't want a black belt. No, they're, because they're I, poop I've heard bad things Yeah, about they're them. not, not good. So we have our choices of, I can't go backwards. We have our choices of mages. Or we could repeat. Oh man, red mages are so cool. And I always never include them because. I, but okay, I don't know. We we didn't plan on this, but mm -hmm. red mage is pretty cool. We red could do that. Pretty cool. We could do a red mage and white mage. Or I don't know how, what's the. I feel like healing is going to be more important than offense, but I don't know that for sure. I don't know that either. Are we gonna? This is like oh, it's like we're coming into it for the first time. Well, you know, the default party <laughs> only has one character that could possibly heal, in that it just has one red mage. That's Although true. I guess the fighter does the eventually fighter get fighter gets white magic, magic eventually. Yeah, yeah. Um, red mage I think is more useful early on too because obviously yeah, you can. But he comes like a red wizard, I think. Yeah, they all become their color wizards. Wiz yeah, you know? <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure. I think yeah, mm -hmm. some kind of. So we want a red mage. I, th I think so. Okay. Let's do it. I've never done it. I feel like I'm like you know spending five bucks. My, on my classic bar. party was two fighters, two red mages, and it took Ooh. forever because it was the grindiest party of all time. That seems you really had cool, to though. buy so many spells See. and weapons. <laughs> oh yeah, because you have to pay for yeah, one. That's true. I had uh, this. This was a kind of a curveball. Mm -hmm. Um. The oh the red mage. Was the red the, mage. Uh, I thought you had a name that was going to be a curveball. No, no. Um, I kind of, I don't know what it is. I just have the inkling that he's a real Andy. I don't know why he just feels Ooh. like an Andy. You know why I like that too? Mm -hmm. It's also, it can also be androgynous, like the yeah. uh, Red Mage. So let's go with Andy. Yeah. It could be Andrea. It's, it's New York. It could be yeah. Andrew. The 80s. We don't know. I'm, I'm totally into that. We'll Let's find out as, as the character develops. Absolutely. Absolutely. Now, for our fourth and final character, our most momentous choice. I think... Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to go with White Mage. That's, white. that's what I'm thinking. Okay. I also think, I could be wrong, but I think the White Mage is slightly stronger in physical combat than the Black Mage. Really? I think so. I didn't know they had operative differences. Okay. I think so. Like, they, like you know, like White Mage equips, like, you'll see it, like, stabs and stuff, mm -hmm. where the Black Mage has, like, daggers and things. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. So what is our White Mage's name? Hmm. My first thought is Lisa, but you can, we can workshop that. It is, it is kind of funny how the white mage is like conventionally a woman. I don't know why. There's nothing about that sprite that indicates female to me. I think actually kind of all the sprites are pretty, I mean, could be Yeah, but like, debatable. They, they're, they're all very like interpretive, but for whatever re reason, like, don't right. you, haven't you gotten the impression from the community that white mages are, are women? Yeah, I think so. And that might be because in later portrayals, like, they are stereotypes. Oh, like in tactics, aren't they? Um, no, you, you can be either. Oh, can um, you? Yeah, okay. you can have multi. Yeah, exactly. But I think, like, um, say, like Final Fantasy IV, like the White Mage, like that was one's It's like story based. Like mm -hmm. they have fixed classes. The yeah, the like Rosa is the White okay. Mage or something like that. Yeah. So we're thinking Lisa. I'm thinking. I mean, unless you want to name her something else. No, I like Lisa. Lisa's okay. a good name. Let's yeah. Let's go Lisa. I feel like we're naming our children. I know. I think. Yeah, Lisa's kind of, and then, you know, maybe not. No, I think Lisa's her own woman. I was going to say, maybe they have a kind of on-again, off-again romance with Tony, but I think yeah, it's more she's, of a... Yeah, she's a strong, independent white man. I think they just run the pizza place together. That's kind of what I think. Yeah, right, co-owners. Trouble and Andy's, well, co Andy's the eccentric one. <laughs> You know, always experimenting. And he's the weirdo pizzas. that never leaves and eats pizza every day. <laughs> yeah, lives above the pizza place. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I love this. So this is our party. Yeah. A fighter, a thief, a red mage, and a woo mage. <laughs> mage. <laughs> Welcome. Yeah, we did it. We did it. All right. Oh, I don't and remember it, that sound effect. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Like, and... After it is kind of interesting, it totally just drops you in. Yeah, I mean we're just here. Nothing, God, no guidance. These graphics—they are an upgrade from. Aren't they? Warrior. Well, they're less colorful, I think. They're less colorful, but like they look better too. They look sharper, yeah. Like the forest looks very foresty. Yeah. Am I wrong? No, it looks very. It's foresty. a very foresty forest. Man, I don't remember these transition noises. <laughs> they're pretty bomb, right? What in I, the world? I, I, I know, it's awesome though. <laughs> and how cool is that? That's like the first thing you get. It's the dream city. Yeah. 
recording. These sound effects, I don't remember them at all. Oh yeah, man, it's wonderful. You could, I actually, that's kind of cool because in Dragon Ball you didn't really get that, except from him booping in the wall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, and yeah, classic menu noise. Which was really like a thing through Final Fantasy VII, at least. Yeah. Nine and eight, probably. Also. I don't know why I said those backwards, but... <laughs> Let's just talk to some folks. Here oh, on, the dance. dancer. What a cool name. Wait, dance. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not fulfilling your namesake. She's just telling you about her occupation. Yeah. She's not on, on duty. Is that what you say when you're a dancer? Like, <laughs> like, like, when, like when I'm at work, I'm on, I'm on duty. Oh man, this is back in the day when you don't get comparisons. Mm -hmm. We already have. Um, hang on. Let's. I want to see. Do I have a menu? Okay. I think you have to hit start. Yeah. Huh. And there's a set. Yeah, weapon and armor. Oh, no one, no one has it. Right. Okay. So everyone's just naked to start. Yeah. I yeah, I have nothing. Yeah, and this is you have nothing. I mean, it's it's been a, a little bit of you know, I was gonna say physical time. That's not how you'd say that. Um, actual time yeah. since we played Dragon Warrior, but mm -hmm. you and I. Oh, <laughs> Those... there, that was a cat explosion. There's blood <laughs> everywhere. Um, we're just gonna ignore it because frankly, yeah. it's too traumatic. Don't worry about that. Um, Four characters versus one is quite a difference, especially when yeah. the shot mechanic is not that much more advanced at this point. Yeah. Honestly, it was. I, I've been. I'll try to wipe this whole time, but like when I was playing Fire Emblem recently, and even that game doesn't really, I don't think, tell you mm -hmm. what. It doesn't have like super advanced shot mechanic. But anyway, um, I think you want a rapier I, for a fighter. Mistaken. I think so. What about our red mage? Can he use a? He uh, click on it real quick, actually. Oh no! I was thinking they might do the thing where they like raise their arms. Mm -hmm. we'll Actually, what you could do is buy one and then yeah, and just see, see who can equip it. it. Yeah. yeah. Let's do that. The music is great too. I don't yeah. know if this is the so first soundtrack that old Nobuo recorded, but <laughs> yeah, it's okay, pretty so, wacky. So Brad, <laughs> some mind warping. Too. He's got a bloop all day. <laughs> it's a lot of bloopity bloopity bloop. bloop, bloop. I know. <laughs> I'm all for gratuitous blooping. And especially because I'm like not pressing the buttons in an efficient way. Okay, so Tony, Brad, <laughs> okay, and Andy good. can all so equip need, the rock here. We need three of these. That's pretty good, though, because we're going to be uh, killing it right off the bat, I think. Yeah, I mean, it's relatively cheap considering the amount of gold you start with. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know the spells are insane. And the armor is expensive also. I don't remember what the hammer is for. I imagine maybe Tony could use the hammer, but I don't know. Iron hammer. Do you see that, that guy, rather than a lake behind him, as in Dragon War, he just has a bunch of swords? <laughs> also, look at that sprite. He's like Leather Daddy. I love it. <laughs> he kind of looks like he's wearing gauntlets. Wait, I like, think the mages could use hammers. Okay. I'm going to buy one. And actually, I think up. that's why. Because uh, I was thinking, yeah, she could use the... The hammer and oh, whoops. Uh, black mage can only use that little pithy dagger. You know? Yeah. Yeah, she can definitely use that. Okay. It's weird too that you don't have to like put them in a particular location. Yeah, it's why just is kind this of over anywhere. here? Because they can carry up to four items per person. They can carry four weapons? Yeah, I think that's what I meant. Okay. Sorry. Um, right. Yeah, it's armor. It's shield time. Let's yeah. talk to that fella down there. Yeah, what's up? I love these sprites. Revive the power of the orbs! <laughs> Warriors! We wanted to make sure that you got that. Yeah. Also, maybe we should check that well. See if uh, there's a lassie inside. Oh, this is a well. You might think that there is something to it, but in fact, it is just an ordinary well. <laughs> <laughs> that is so verbose. It really is so far. Also, I love that they put that there. <laughs> oh, shield guy is like, oh my god. What do you bet that there's a rivalry between shield guy and sword guy? He's like, I hang shields from my wall. <laughs> oh, he's got, like, they keep adding shields. The great thing is that yeah. this guy doesn't even sell shield. Like, there's no shield here. <laughs> You're right. It's, I mean, and that makes sense because... It's complicated. Dude, right? He gets that all the time, yeah. okay? Also, I like that you have to leave to try it on. Like, you're, there's not <laughs> Wait, enough excuse room. Excuse me one moment. Yeah, stop changing room. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so Brad can't. I, I want to say that I bet fighter is the only guy who can wear a chain. 
Oh, Red, yeah. Red Mage can wear a lot of the stuff Red that Mage. fighters can. Wow, I did not know that. That's really cool. One more set for Tony. I'm liking our choice, actually. Yeah, this is a cool party. I'm into it. I guess this game tells you right from the beginning, actually. Once you go back to the menu, you can peep some shiz real quick. So, I noticed that cloth doesn't get an armor icon like wooden and chain do. Yeah. It makes me wonder if wooden and chain are a type of armor that only the fighter type characters can wear, and then cloth is going to be what? I really think the thief can wear wooden. I'm not okay. 100% of it. Well, I mean, what's the worst that happens? We have to we lose a little gold. gold. Yeah. It's not like we haven't grind, ground for yeah. 400,000 hours and gained. I'm going to buy a cloth as well. It, is the correct wording gained dragon madness? <laughs> it's now a permanent condition that we I have succumbed with. to dragon madness. Oh, yeah. There you go. That was, mine was the translation. Yeah. Thou hast gained dragon madness. Oh, see? Alright, now. Totally let me double check and see that uh, Lisa can't. Yeah. Wear some I don't wood. think so. Also, nope. this, I think you. No, she sure can't. Oh, yeah, not at all. I'm not 100%, but I think if you go up from the top menu also, when you hit like equip and then go. Huh? Yeah, if you hit up. No. Oh, you have to go down every time? I well, I mean, but yeah, it, it, it rolls mm. around if I pick an option. Up here. Oh, I cool, didn't realize cool. that's what you were trying to say. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I can't roll around like yeah, that. Yeah. Okay, oh, so see, no. oh, that's what I was going to point out, though, is you've got four orb slots already. Oh, yeah. You, you're <laughs> There are four key items. They're the only ones that matter. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I mean I we really don't know a whole lot, except we're in Corneria, the dream city. Yeah. And um, we're no longer that's, nude. It's just an ordinary well. <laughs> and warriors, please retrieve the orbs, which I presume uh, those those orb shapes in our inventory are. Yeah. You know, places. And there's a professional dancer. Yes, Ar 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 Arilan. Arilan. Oh. Oh, oh. Wait, we have a princess to save. I'm used to that. Oh. I'll check. I'll check it. Okay. Can we just do it real quick before we talk to this guy? Mm -hmm. Some old man sprite appreciation. Look at that dope. That beard. Also, the best part of this old man is that he is totally dancing. He's boogieing yeah, he's all day long. Down. Yeah, is... these other sprites don't really have idle animations like he does, but he's just busting. He is. Well, the other ones are walking. That's why he's just grooving in place. Mm -hmm. That's gorgeous. Um, he's kind of he's like a skinnier old wizard compared to our kind of cute round stout wizard in Dragon Warrior. Was truly bizarre. Well, like they were also very hunchbacky. They too. were, they were, they were very cute. Though. What's what's weird is that he has an idle walking animation like that, and we don't. True. You know what? I think it's because if you change the order of your character in the menu, you can change which sprite you see. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. I could be wrong about that. How would I do that? Well, maybe you can't change it. But if you chose someone else as a fighter, oh. your main character, I think, would be something else. I didn't realize I was choosing who we see the entire game. I think this is probably the default, but that's hmm. really interesting. I didn't really thought about that. Lucan left this town. L Lucan? Yeah, I like Lucan. Let's fantasy Lucan. it up. Yeah. To join his colleagues at Crescent Lake. Oh, that that sounds like Lucan worked at the university here, yeah. and he left to join the community college. At, <laughs> you know, <I'm, laughs> I don't think we can afford. Oh, any of those. Yeah. I think there's a thing oh, going on with one. with these guys, you know. There's a little bit of a... Look at him. Keep up with the Joneses Look at kind that of shopkeep sprite. Yeah, he is terrifying. He's I, scary as shit. It's actually kind of... It's a little... Do you, do you notice how the menu at the top even is in, in grayscale? Be magic up there? Oh, it's not quite grayscale. It's purple oh. in, in background. What? The... the It's got a white border, and Whoa. the letters are white, and then it's purple. Oh, it's purple? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, ruining everything for me, eyes and brain. <laughs> God. So for those of you who did not join us for Dragon Warrior, uh, Corey is colorblind. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Grays so and purple. Is there more purple? Classic. Is this purple too? Yeah, it's the same. Oh, I except do. except the the shopkeep sprite, the desk, and the pots are all blue. Can I have a real, for no apparent reason? Can I have a witchcraft tangent real quick? Yeah. Okay. With, I I don't know enough about this to um, speak in detail, mm -hmm. but. If you consider, I, I don't really know where to go with this, but I like that the witch is actually has he, uh, healing magic, uh, though harm is one of the spells, but she has the white magic rather than the black magic, mm -hmm. which instead of, you know, demonizing the witch here, we've actually given her the healing magic. 
which is kind of cool. Yeah. Not that, not to say that the black mage, you know, is necessarily. <laughs> the black mage is like the aspect of death and is utterly terrifying to look at. So I guess right. it should sell the most. Damage. But I, I, I'm totally into this. Yeah. Rather than be demonized as you know. Yeah. As evil. The witch is uh, providing your white magic here. So I don't know why I gave Andy cure to start with, but Andy has cure now. I think you can. Uh... Oh yeah. No one needs to remember HP. But so once you give it to Andy, you can't move it? Nope. Wait, what if you go to magic? Oh, I see. Oh, because you probably asked you, like, I probably wasn't yeah, paying attention. It just lets you it. Well, I mean, I guess we'll probably end up with both Andy and Lisa being able to cure, and Andy will get fire and lightning as other level one magic. That's true. And Lisa will we get... could probably treat Andy like the black mage and give him most of those spells. Yeah. Um, but he can also punch things, which is great. Let's talk about this guy. Go ahead, Ryan. You be the guard here. The king is sure that someday the Light Warriors will come to save the princess, just as in Lucan's prophecy. Oh, so Lucan, who He's moved over to uh, Crescent Lake Community College, uh, he had some prophesying <laughs> on the side. I possibly peer reviewed and published. <laughs> uh, but maybe, hey, I just want to. Maybe we are these full caps light warriors. Maybe. I think, think you might that's, be right. You think that's possible? It, I think we could be the Light Warriors. So, yes, yes. That, I do love that. I absolutely love that. What's interesting to me is that, like, there are clearly squares. Yeah. But you can talk to someone who's walking away from you mid-walk. Like that. Look at that. Oh, nothing here. Oh, wait, what? They she, she was too quick for you. <laughs> I'm just chasing her. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> oh, he's... People walk I, I feel like they, they there's a lot of development from Dragon Warrior though. I feel like this town feels a lot more alive, like some of Definitely. the second, like the later towns that we access. Yeah, for sure. So some of these guys are pretty wacky looking. Beautiful port city, far east of here. All right, that's nice. That's very nice actually. And this is like, oh, this is the clinic. Look at that guy. He's pretty serious about resurrection right now. You do not need my help now. He also has an awesome beard. Like he, his head is so big. I mean, I know everybody's head is big, but his head is especially big. I yeah. Love it. <laughs> also, he gets pillars. I just kind of like that. Most Three characters pillars. are about 50% head and 50% the rest of their body. Also, can we take it just a moment hmm. to enjoy the really soothing and wistful music right from the very beginning? It's pretty good. It's, it's kind of sad. And... I mean, it's... this town seems to be under no immediate threat. It, it's kind of more like someone's pressing down on it. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it, Like... It's it's not the shimmering it's general city malaise. of dreams. Yeah. yeah, something threatening it. Yeah, it's it's wistful dreams. Or dreams for a better dream past. city. See your face upon the clean water. How dirty! Come wash your face. Wait. Yeah, I got it. We did it. Nailed it. <laughs> Great line reading. One hundred percent. Um. Yeah. All Let's right. go to see the king. Okay. This king, I bet, is very different from King Warwick, who I really we just didn't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we're, we're gonna get plenty of that. There's song. a little bit of lag, yeah. I'll, I'll be I'll be able to hum it along with the music as we go. <laughs> I don't know that you need to do that. I need to do that pretty much all the time, oh, basically. Okay. Otherwise, suck for these fellas. The king is looking for the light warriors. You do not happen to be them, do you? I feel like they'd know. <laughs> <laughs> He's just politely insinuating. Look at those. Uh, also, hold on. This is to to totally cool. I'll step out of here real quick. Guess what we got in this one? Ceilings that we didn't have in Dragon Warrior. Also, Ooh. like, ceilings that don't take, like, a solid, like, second to load. Like, it's just, like... Let's look at that sick booming fast. noise. Yeah. yeah. And a dragon griffin fireplace <laughs> with stools. Oh. My sister. Oh, the princess's sister, do you think? I, I have to imagine... <laughs> Like, Sorry. she's the junior princess, the senior princess is the one that's missing. So, uh, princess 2, yeah. yeah. No, and the king? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Man, they were told to say that, I think. Yeah. Trained. The movement in this game feels so much better. Does it? Like, yeah, that's something miles you're... better. Jane, Queen of Corneria, <laughs> please save my doctor, Princess Sarah. That is not a regal name. Jane? Jane, Queen of Corneria. Queen Jane? Is Jane short for something? Uh, it could be short for Janet. Is it? I mean, Jane. probably not in all scenarios. I think Jane John. is a legitimate name. 
Yeah, I guess you're right. It's weird to have a one syllable name that isn't a, some sort of contraction. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Short name, I guess. What are other names like that? You think of any? Mark. That, that aren't a short. Yeah, yeah, Mark's a good one. Paul? Yep, Paul. Uh, um, Saul. Any all, really? Yeah, that's true. I need you to move, thank you. Wait, what did she say? Please save the princess. Cool. Ooh. Garland used to be a good knight. I know. Da, da, da. Ellipsis. Ellipsis. What's ellipses? And so far, the characters in, the, in this game really like their ellipses. I love that boogie and old man because I just kind of was like, I just found out I had a chicken in my hat. <laughs> and he's just, he just he's says, really thrilled about it. <laughs> also, check okay, out this, okay. this this new technology. Oh yeah, you do not have do not have to press. The oh, stairs and button. I feel like the game is like, check out. It's like, yo, you don't have to press no buttons when you click on the stairs. Yeah. It's like, woobity, 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 <laughs> you know? It feels like a Star Wars transition. It's so cool. Oh, it's like an actual screen wipe. I love it. Okay. Also, like, we are now in the castle in the sky. Uh, <laughs> it's the dream city. It is the dream in. city. Garland was the princess in a temple to the northwest. Ooh, in a temple. It's kind of weird that these guys just, like, know where princess is at. And this guy's just chilling in this weird wing. I feel like he's avoiding his guard duties. Yeah, a little bit. That but, corner uh, did not seem like it needed guarding. The pillars are also in rows of three, which is must be in fashion here to have rows, sets of three. Three a bit, swords, a three shields. More widely spaced apart, but yeah. Three cauldrons or whatever. What did the witch have? I don't remember. And we'll have to see you next time we're there. Yeah, I mean, we'll be back. And they're really pushing it. Oh, 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 he's got double griffins. It's lonely at the top. It is. Just as in Lucan's prophecy, Garland has kidnapped the princess. Please help her! Two exclamation marks. That's how you know he means it. Uh, two is an odd number. We don't even know this king's name. That's, that's all he has to say. Alright. You know, I I still, I have a... Mm, what? I have a little hole in my heart for King Loric and his oh, room full of desks. Yeah, he's a nice guy. I really think that... Oh, that might have been one of my favorite parts of that game, to be completely honest <laughs> with <Lord>. you. <laughs> We're not tied to any kings. We just have a little group of friends here. Yeah, for those of you just joining us for this game, we played through Dragon Warrior as a prologue to our Final we Fantasy. Did. We did, because um, it was kind of the you know original JRPG. It's the first JRPG, and it's the, the game that uh, Square was kind of trying to copy a little bit when yeah. they made Final Fantasy. Of course, uh, they did a lot better. But... Treasure was locked by the Mystic Key. Ancestors gave the key to the Prince of Elfland for safekeeping. So this one has a secret uh, treasure dungeon, just like the the castle in Tantigal. Yes, Tantigal. Why? Why? Oh. Why are there two All of you? <laughs> <laughs> why? One has a chicken in his hat. One has a chicken in his pants. It's, Whoa! It's, 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 it's weird. It's, uh, oh, wait, are they boogieing in unison? I'm sure. Unison they are. boogie. Oh, that's 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 wonderful. Yeah, it seems that way. I like that. I like that. Happening. I don't think there's anything over here. I don't think so either. But uh, for completion's sake. Oh, you just stepped in the lawn. <laughs> How dare you? You're gonna kick me out. We did it. Okay, so Wait, that's what we know now. Awesome. Light warriors, uh, orbs, and uh, a princess is missing. So that's kind of our first order of business. Ooh, oh, look at that! We're hiding the trees. There's a lot of little technical advancements that are pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> Very first battle in Final Whoa. Fantasy. Can we just real quick? That was really fast. It was, see that it was super <laughs> fast. This is gonna be wacky crazy, I bet. Um, but I mean, this one doesn't have a time system, so it's not like you're. It's just showing yeah. you what happens really quickly. Like the text you can just, just hold down the button, I think, and it will actually oh, run really? through. But, oh, oh, wait. There's one specific thing though. This one. Now we have four dudes, right? Yeah. Um, if you if you swing at someone who has already died your attack will be wasted. Yeah. So that's a thing. So you, it's it's usually in your best interest to swing at different people. Yeah. You kind of have even, to estimate... Even if you leave a couple alive. Yeah, you kind of have to estimate who's going to take the hit. So sometimes and because like, I don't know yet how strong everyone yeah, is, I we'll kind of want to see. We'll get a sense of it, yeah. absolutely. All right, let's see what happens. Let's do it. Got him. That's pretty quick. I think that's readable, though. I mean, you could always pause it if you really want to read what's happening. Oh, man, everyone's just... We're baller. just killing it right now. Did uh, the even then. take a turn? Um, I don't know. Okay, this is a lot better than having a black mage. Yeah, who needs a black mage? 
Monsters perished. Whoa. Oh. All right. I'm just. Well, you get paid that, then. That's that, 30 G's. And that sweet, sweet victory theme. Oh yeah. Which I will. To, I, need to, I need to give that some more time. Yeah, we'll give it. There's a lot of firsts here that will. We'll, we can trace the threads. Of, yeah. Down the yeah. down the this years. This is this is our origin story well, here. Oh, they snuck up. And then hold on, the bass line's gonna start. And it kind of picks up the black background from the Dragon Warrior dungeon screen. Mm-hmm. This has a lot more information, Oops. I think, to process. <laughs> Already fucked that up. Oh, that's all right. But I mean, like, like look at all the stuff that Dragon Warrior didn't have. Like, little, like, dust clouds when you hit them. Yeah. Moving sprites when they attack, you know? Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah, this is a huge technical leap forward. And the backgrounds change, too. Like, it's not always... Obviously, it's only trees because you're in the forest. Right. Oh, they also, like, do their great, like... Raising the roof, kind of. That's his. It's yeah, it's really subtly cool. hopeful. Oh, I love it. It's the synth bass that I love. That's it. That's the whole loop. <laughs> it's great though. It's it's really good. There'll be great ones as we go on. This the overall music is great too. Yeah, it's good stuff. I wonder how much this gets reprised because I feel like it, this song in particular get, has dropped off a little bit. The yeah. battle music is still like being built upon in the modern games. I feel like the overworld themes really match the individual games. Yeah, they're more representative of mm-hmm. their their home game. Yeah, some of them are just great. Like, oh man, there's a, yeah. I think that's that's one thing that we it's maybe easy to overlook when you're doing when we're considering this project is that there's a lot of great music that we're oh. going to be exposed to it's one of my favorite things about the series oh my goodness the music I love New Louis Matsu too though because it's like I don't know like actually he has a thing it, honestly I have no idea if this if I'm just getting it mixed up because our name is Good Friends but he has like Dear Friends is, <laughs> is he uses sometimes as um I don't remember if it's like a label that he has or a group, but like Dear Friends is a song, I think, one of the pieces. Mm-hmm. But like he has like Dear Friends music or something like that. Hmm. It's just very sweet and I don't know. It emphasizes those qualities about that you feel in the music. Yeah. Their warmth and hope. I really I, I can't emphasize enough coming from Dragon Warrior how much more responsive this game is. Like you menu faster, you move faster, you don't have this weird, like, chunky movement system where you're, like, if That's you just so tap the button, sometimes you don't move at all, and you kind of have to hold it a little bit in Dragon Warrior, where in this game it's just, like, it's just instantly responsive. Like, I don't know. You're just speeding along, too, yeah. It's good. It's and really good. last time I played this, I had I did not realize that you could set the battle speed, so I was playing it in, like, super slow-mo, yeah. which makes a huge difference, too. I mean, that completely changes the pace of the game. Oh yeah, for sure. It's still relatively. I know we had a discussion about this, but it's kind of changes the pace of the the game. But this makes it more modern seeming. I think. Yeah, for sure. Very quick. It's also. I, don't know, I just noticed that one of the hmm. menu options in the battle screen is drink, which is oh. separate from item. Wow, we should check this out, because I have no idea what that means. I mean, I guess it's just for probably consuming healing items. Can we look at that bomb-ass castle, too, by the way? Yeah, that that sprite's Oh, yeah, I never noticed that before. Alright, let's drink. Let's see, uh, what can you drink? Nothing. No, that's kind of what I expected, but... Hmm. Maybe you have to have potions. I need to remember that Brad's my guy that misses. Yeah, he does miss a lot. On the regular, right now. Yeah, that, that's where you can start, like, overlapping them. Mm-hmm. Like, Brad and the White Mage, maybe? Lisa? I'm just kind of mixing it up, seeing, seeing who's good for what. Love it. There you go. We're kind of killing it, though. Yeah. I think right, right Mage was the red choice. <laughs> yep.